He's warm and he's fuzzy. I kiss him the most out of anyone in my family. He's my best friend. He's my dog, Jake. My little Jakey Poo is my yellow lab. He is my third son. My best behaved son, actually. <laughs> He's usually parked at my right hand side underneath my desk. And it's amazing. Dogs, I believe, definitely have a, a sense of who needs them. That dog gets more kisses than any human I know. I want the doctor to look at his paw. Okay. Okay. No problem. He's got something going on. How you doing? Oh, yes, sure. You like a tree? So which paw here has got the growth on? Um, I think it's his left paw. paw. Okay. He does not like his feet touched, so you can see he's clearly unhappy. And he limps on it too, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you feel all the way up here in between. And you can feel this thing. It's pretty good size. Oh. Right? Yeah. It's got size of a great. You know, it's getting surgically excised. Yeah. And because uh, the thing you worry about if it happens to be something that's uh, metastatic, you know, cancerous. Kind of what we're going to do is put them on some antibiotics, and it's a chance it could just be an infection. If it is, hopefully it goes down. That's the end of it. I'm upset. I mean, I'm concerned about his talk. He's getting to be a little bit older. He's almost nine, and if it's not an infection, I'm a little bit afraid of what it might be. Yeah, he's, he'll be okay, man. You know, he's, doctor, the veterinary said it was genetic. You know, these things happen with these dogs quite often. He'll be all right. You know what, though? I traced his whole family line. Yeah. And he came from a puppy mill, and that really bugs me because, you know, they puppy just, mill pu They breed them and stuff. They, they do, and they end up having a lot of problems. Sneak out. He my boy. Come on. Give mommy a kiss. Come on. Right here. Ah, no. You missed me. Give me that kiss. Give me that kiss. Give me that kiss. You better come over here and give me some lips. Little beast. <laughs>